All right, guys, Levi Trumbull reporting here. Today, we're going to bring you a story that comes directly from one of the viewers. I have a communication which was sent right here. So what this viewer claims is going on is that a few weeks ago, he claims he was the subject of an unjust battery by an off-duty jail warden. This all takes place in Little Rock, Arkansas, and he claims that this all stems from a visit to a jailhouse in which he was arrested because he refused to leave public property. And then, several weeks down the line, he ran into the same jail warden yet again at a Mexican restaurant. This viewer claims that he said, F you to the jail warden, and that is when an altercation broke out. That is when he was battered by this off-duty jail warden. Now, with this communication, I was also sent two videos. One video was a cell phone video, which was taken by this individual when he was at the jailhouse during the time of his arrest. And the second video is body camera footage, which was taken by the police department when they arrived on scene for the battery that allegedly took place at this Mexican restaurant. So I have those two videos. We are gonna bring them to you now and you can decide for yourself what is going on here. Okay, am I, am I restricted property? Is this a private prison? It's a prison. Is it private? You know yes, sir. Is, is it private? Is it private? No, you okay, it's public. You're welcome here. What? You're welcome here. Thank you. I'm gonna go now. I don't know how you're gonna go. Are you a cop? You're a correction officer. Is that a corrections officer or a cop? I don't know if this is public this property. Is this is public property. Yeah, it doesn't matter. It's public. You can't do that. Is he a cop? Is he a firm cop? Anytime you come to a prison, your vehicle is subject Oh, you're not searching anything of mine. If you look at that sign, when y'all pass You're not searching nothing. You know what's going to be funny? You're not searching nothing. I don't care. Is this restricted property? Anyway, talk to somebody act like yes, this is. Oh, I, I, I study law. I know all this stuff. But anyway, I was just going here. <sighs> anyway, when you pass that sign, you're subject. Well, you're not searching. You're not searching. Are. You're not searching me. I'm going to go, well, and nothing's going to happen. Where's your supervisor? Where's your supervisor? Okay. Where's your supervisor? Where's your supervisor? Where's your supervisor? You know what? Let me park. I'm going to wait, and I'm going to film all around here. That's what I'm going to do. That's exactly what I'm about ready to do. It's public. It's public, so he can. I'm looking up. I'm just telling you. Because ain't nobody got sense around here. Trying to leave. Talking to me? Are you a supervisor? Yeah. I'm trying to leave. Can I leave? Whoa, 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 whoa. What you doing up here? I'm allowed to. This no, is public property. No, it's not. Yes, it is. So what you doing? Get a cop here? over here. I want to leave. I'm trying to leave. 
That's all I'm trying to do at this point. I want to leave. Can I leave? No, you can't. Oh, okay. And who, who funds that? Who funds that? Oh, 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 oh. Don't answer anything. Oh, you're not getting any answers from me. I kind of wish you let me leave. You're so stupid. It's not. It's publicly funded. Taxpayers fund this. Are you? Are you the or something? You're exactly right. You're exactly right. And out here, call the police. Call the police. Thank you. I'm trying to leave. Well, they're coming, so. I'm not going in the building. Hey, go ahead. Hey, coffee. Coffee? Coffee. Come on with it. All right. No, you're not, you're not touching me. Are you a cop? Um, this is my... Hey, man, don't play with me. You're not cuffing me. Yes, I am. No, you're not. Yeah, I record. Taylor, get my phone. Hey, Taylor, get out this car. Get my get the same treatment. Don't delete any evidence. Don't delete any evidence. How you doing? Hey, what's going on? Hi, I'm Superintendent D'Angelo Earl. I work down here at the prison. These guys right here were escorted off the compound a couple of weeks ago by the sheriff, by the state troopers. They arrested them. So when they see me up here getting food, they come out, threatening me to stand the other, circling the parking lot, running around the parking lot. Oh, you fat mother, we got you out here in the public. Now we going to get you. So I come back in here, this, that, and other. So he on the inside then. Then when he threw me, I came inside and I knocked his ass out. And the other one didn't get out the car. That's exactly what I did. What car are they at? They in this beat up one right here. And say true, but Jess locked them up about three, four weeks ago down there at the unit, trying to make a drop, and they locked them up. Coach ID? I'm just really shaking up right now. I, I think I'm getting this. They're coming. I walked in there. He followed me in there. And I said, what do you say? I said, you. And then he just punched me right in the face. In the warden? Of the Wrightsville prison. Oh, okay. I was driving. I said, is that the warden to him? Is that the warden? He's like, yeah. So I pulled right there. I said, hey, I f*** you to him. I made, I said, f*** you to him. All right. They went up to my car and said, who are you? And you do like, this is the window. By the hey, no, he, he tried to rip the rear view mirror off. Or the side, side mirror? He ripped my handle off. He tried to rip it. He ripped his handle off, trying to open the door. He was on the window up. So he, the, the dude, the warden, I'll whatever you his name it. is. He should have right, gone for a punch. He couldn't punch him. Are you listening? I'm listening. Oh, okay. Not bad. So he tried to go for a punch, but the window was rolled up. Like it was, it was going, it was rolling up, and he tried to go for a punch. And that's when I was like walked off because I don't want to deal with it. Did they see it in there? Everyone saw it in there. Come over here. Let's go talk to the ambulance. He's got a little cut. Oh. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> No worries about that. What's your name? Christian. What's your birthday? 72399. Day is it? I know. See, he's looking at the door like, there he, he comes. He's phone out like he's going to record him. He didn't have enough time because he saw the hit coming. But why would he stand right from the door? Because he see, knows he's coming in for him. That don't matter. I don't know. I... Hey, the way he's in the wrong. Which so, one? What you mean? I'm saying, which one is in the wrong? The one that punched him. Mm. Yeah, look. So on this battery that I'm working right now, uh, the guy is the warden of the Wrightsville prison. He said he came here to pick up some food. He saw some people that uh, state police had arrested for trying to make a drop out in their field. Uh, said that the guys threatened him. One of them went inside the restaurant. He went inside the restaurant. And then the warden punched that guy that had threatened him. So we reviewed the camera footage, and uh, we can't see any threats being made outside. All we see is the warden coming in and uh, punching the guy. All right, just trying to give you a heads up because we got the the warden involved in this. We'll document it and. Uh,
have him contact the prosecutor's office. We're going to document it and refer them both to the prosecutor's office for threats and to the other. That's what I referred them to. So. It's a misdemeanor assault uh -huh. with minor injuries. It's going to have to be referred to the prosecutor's office for charges. I can't, I can't verify what threats were made to him okay. to elicit that kind of response out of him. Okay. And you said you made threats to his life. That's great because I, I have every thing audio recorded. Do you have an audio? Do you have a yeah. camera on your? Uh, I have it right here. Mind if we take this to enter it as evidence? Uh, could I? Can I? Is there any way I can get, give you a copy of it? Because I'm gonna submit everything to my lawyer, or do you just need it now? I, I can't erase anything. Huh? I can't pull anything off of it here. Okay. It would get turned into evidence for our detectives to review. Yeah.